What is up, everyone? Oh, wait, first I gotta do the intro. Another week, another adventure. Let's go! What is up, everyone? Look at me, I'm all ready for St. Patty's Day, man. We're heading to the city center. Gonna enjoy some music, some parades, the whole nine yards, bro. We're gonna go ham today. Um, yeah, it's gonna be so much fun. So let's just head over and uh, start the celebration. So we finally got to the city center. It's gonna be about an hour and a half until the parade starts. So we're just gonna sit here. We got a nice view of the city, so we're gonna have a lot of fun today. It's raining right now sucks but um we're just gonna power through and have fun today so let's go
nip, nini bow. Ma nip, grana nip, nini bow. Just got done with the parade. Let's go. I've never seen anything like it. It was definitely lived up to the hype that I thought that uh, it was gonna be. So it was, it was amazing. And the uh, next thing I'm gonna do, I just had lunch at um, a Subway cause the pubs right now are crazy popping. Like there's no way that I could have gotten into one to go eat maybe later tonight. But yeah, you never know. But yeah, it's just crazy right now. There's so many people from all around the world here right now. So it's super busy. But yeah, next thing I'm gonna do is they have a music festival going on downtown that I'm gonna go visit and see what's up. So yeah, happy Patrick's Day, everyone. Or as they call it here, St. Patty's Day. And yeah, I'm just gonna get rocking and rolling and enjoying the day. So let's go. What's up? Hope you guys um, enjoyed the parade. I realized looking back through all the footage I did that I really didn't talk about um, what happened much. But yeah, so it was this huge parade. The, um, the whole thing uh, spanned about like two-ish miles and it took like two hours to go through. So that definitely was not the whole thing. I only filmed about like half of it, but because a lot of it was getting repetitive because um, this was the whole list of all the acts. Uh, the theme for it was uh, We Are One. Um, I think that was because like after coronavirus and all that, they were wanting to bring the community back together and stuff. So they did that by making that the theme, I guess. Um, but yeah, there were a lot of like weird ones. Like as you, the alien one was pretty weird. Um, and some other ones were weird, but, um, other than that, uh, some of them did have, like, subliminal messaging, uh, like the alien one, or like, oh, we need to let aliens in, or, I don't know, I, I couldn't even read whether they were, um, just stunts, or, I don't know, but yeah, for the most part, yeah, it was, it was great, and, um, there were so many bands, I couldn't even keep track of all of them. Uh, a lot of a lot of high schools. There was one from Tyler, Texas. I already pointed that out. But um, uh, now we're going to move on to the next segment in our show called Rants with Paul. And so yeah, I, ho I hope you guys enjoy this little section where I just rant. Today I had my really my biggest culture shock moment since I've been here, and it had to do with the restrooms. So I was trying to find a restroom, right? And in the U.S., you know, you can go into, like, any restaurant or whatever and just use the restroom. But, um, I go into McDonald's, no restroom. I go to this gas station, like, place, kind of like a 7-Eleven, no restroom. So I'm, like, panicking, looking all over the city for a restroom. And I finally see a mall. And I'm like, okay, yeah, this mall is definitely going to have a restroom. Go to the top floor of the mall. Sorry. Go to the top floor of the mall and to use the restroom it's 50 cents and it really doesn't seem like a lot but yeah having to pay to use a restroom is a weird concept to me and also later on after the parade i was trying to go find a restroom and a lot of the restrooms like require you to be a customer so they have like locks on them with a keypad and they only give you the code um if you like have to if you buy something before which is like completely foreign to me. And um, I mean, I guess uh, Europe is just built different, but um, yeah, that's definitely not something that you'll ever find in the US. We have bathrooms galore. 
So, I hope you guys enjoy segment Lance with Paul. Uh, you'll probably see him again at some point in the next few videos. But yeah, uh, back to the music and stuff. So, let's go. Yeah, coming home tonight's gonna be a nightmare. I'm taking a bus. Just keeps going. <laughs> That was so much fun. Had a fun day at the parade and then the music festival. I caught the bear like tail end of it. So I wasn't able to see the whole thing, but that was still fun. Um, so yeah, thank you guys for coming along throughout the day. Um, scratch that off my non-existent bucket list, being in Dublin on St. Patrick's Day. That's a pretty cool thing to be a part of. But yeah, hope everyone is having a great week. Um, as of today, right now I'm in Dublin. Just got back from Portugal yesterday. And in the morning, I'm headed to the UK where I'll be there for 10 days. I think 10 or nine days. Anyway, I'll be there for a long time. Got a lot of stuff planned to film. And that's cool. Um, and yeah. So be on the lookout and um, yeah, be, be, be on the lookout in the next couple of weeks for those con content. So yeah, I love you guys. Thanks for watching. Um, if this video gets to three likes, then I will do the gritty at a world wonder. Ooh, which world wonder are you going to, Paul? I don't know. You'll have to see. You'll have to see. So yeah, smash that like button. Uh, this is Paul signing off. Another week, another adventure. Let's go and peace.